forget everything about building apps google just changed the game today i wanted to tell you about opal opal is an experimental product exploring the future of building with ai models and prompts it gives user more control and transparency over combining all the capabilities of google models without having to code describe your idea and google's new ai will turn it into a powerful mini app instantly with zero code now it is available in public beta this is launched only for us once getting the feedbacks it will be rolled out for the more countries that's what it's been told by the creators on x so as you can see opal is an experimental but it's packed with a lot of features it creates workflows you can edit workflows while the app is being created and you can share this app with anyone who got google account with your friends and you can click any of these workflows and edit in natural language just like talking to your friend enough is enough of talking let's jump into the landing page can see build edit and share mini ais it's giving a workflow like generate create apps video assets for my blog information about the blogs display it as a web and i just signed in as you can see there are two ways to get started remix the mini apps from the gallery if you can see there are few already available on the gallery which you can it's been pre-built i can just click and re mix it meaning that you can use your own imagination edit this app or change this app to your taste and ideas and use it for you or share it to your friends or create a new let's create a new one these are all what it is says as ready made in the gallery but let's create a new one okay that's the landing page you can see it's an untitled opal app okay what can you title let's just explore the ui it got this user input generate output add assets add a step to get started or type what you want to build so what i understood is this is to describe what i want to build or what you want to build in natural language and this is a kind of tool to add step by step process to go why should we choose that let's start with natural language and see what happens and if you can see here on the right hand side you got this preview tab console let's see what's on the console while creating and step and theme what is a theme get a random theme theme of the opal app create your own theme okay generate a random theme let's see it's not quick that takes a long 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 time for a uh, AI from Google that is killing my patience. Okay, I'm just gonna close. Oh, okay, just clicking on the board, it just disappears. Okay, that's fine. This is fit to screen, zoom in, zoom out. Okay, that's fine. Let's start. What is this untitled Opal app? What I want to do is take a city name as input and generate here three day food attraction and hidden gems itinerary with ai generated images for each day plus budget thing tip at the end let's see what it creates i want to name it something related to travel let's hit enter and see what happens so opal creates the full workflow it to come that is the workflow it just creates right in front of us untitled opal app 
generate personalized 3 day travel itineraries for any city look at this city name we just need to enter the city name let's let me try to i just zooming in uh -huh. what is it i am not able to go on the left uh -huh. yeah i could just able to drag that is the workflow if you can see that is coming under step enter the city name and i can just directly type in something here please of your trip did it get updated uh, not able to see i think it is updated there okay let's try to just enter one and see if that one gets updated here yeah it gets updated like <laughs> that's the funny thing okay generate travel itinerary and tips look at this you can access the following used in these tips search web search map get map weather enter city look at this come up with a plan to perform the following and generate a detailed 3 day travel itinerary for the specified city including recommendation for food attraction and hidden gems for each day and conclude with relevant budgeting tips <clears throat> this step will use internal tools like google search and map and gather information at once settings strategy go in order all at once think as i go okay i'm just going to leave it on the default let's go to the next one format itinerary and generate image prompts we're an expert travel analyst and it's using gemini 2.5 you can see and for each for enter the city and then it uses Gemini 2.0 flash for travel itinerary and tips and formatting itinerary and generating image prompts it uses Gemini 2.5 flash that's interesting and look at that look at that everything what is available 2.0 flash 2.5 flash 2.5 pro I'm a pro user I got access to pro plan and execute with Gemini that's not even showing up 2.5 agen image in 4 gemini 2.0 flash audio lum view diria to generate music okay now i think it's travel itinerary and tips important note system instruction look at that you are working as part of an ai system so no chit chat and no explanation what you are doing and why do not start with okay all right or from preambles just the output please that's good and uh, next generate daily images image generation as limited free quota it's using image in 4 okay that's fine we are just going to try and web page with auto layout we can choose menu layout web page save it in google docs google slides google sheets okay let it be as in a web page and you says gemini 2.5 okay now let's preview the app let's click start enter the city name is there any maximizing button no what is this plus button okay you can upload from device add youtube video add from google drive add a drawing add a webcam video let's start with barcelona and hit enter it shows the steps what it is working on if you can see here uses the web tool to find of the pit and path locations creating a detailed itinerary for day one the opening hours and ticket prices attractions to visit and that's working on day one let's see how long it takes it's combining three daily itineraries and budgeting tips into a final well formatted document that provides a comprehensive travel guide for barcelona formatting itinerary and generate image prompts it did ask that to name my app. that's not done that's fine it's creating travel itinerary web page look at that at first look i'm impressed that is actually images actual buildings from 
Barcelona. I've been to Barcelona. I've been to all these places. This is a park and that's the entrance of the park and this church is nowhere near this park. And the image and four just imagined and put at the main monumental places into one picture and which is great. I like it. That's the key buildings and the food. Yeah. Okay, day one. <laughs> not applicable. Food not applicable. No, no food on for day one. No attractions. No hidden gems. Just sleep. <laughs> day two. The same. Okay. Day three. The same. Okay, let's see. Yeah, that looks like Barcelona. Yeah. And that is, yes, Barcelona as well. Barcelona's buildings are like this. In The roads will be in square shaped and the buildings will be apartments kind of building where you can go square by square, square by square throughout the whole city. It's been constructed in that way. Budgeting tip. Share output. Please share your Opal first. Share. Look, that's in private. And if you put public, it's going to give you this link. Okay, let's just close it and then try to refresh this page and see. Okay. Let's start. Put a city name. Let me do... Come on. Let's see. I hope that error was in one time error and let's see what it comes up with this time look at this time your three-day coastal city adventure discover the charm flavors and hidden gems of a vibrant coastal city historic waterfront and culinary delights old buildings and boats image and forth failed here Okay, breakfast. Let's see what it says for food recommendation. Grab a fresh pastry and coffee at the Harbour Bakery overlooking the docks. Uh-huh. I've been there. Had some food on this bakery. That was okay. Enjoy fresh seafood tacos. Had Try their famous fish and chips. I had fish and chips in some shops, not on this particular shops. Okay, dinner. Indulge in a fine dining experience at Ocean's Mountain, known for its locally sourced ingredients and stunning views. Attractions. Explore the historic old town with these cobblestone streets and colonial architect. Visit the Maritime Museum and learn about the city's rich seafaring history. Take a scenic ferry ride across the Bay of Panoramic City View. Eden Gems Discover Artist Halley, a vibrant lane filled with local tea tart and small galleries. Find the secret garden behind the old lighthouse, perfect for a quiet moment. Okay, that's good actually, not bad. Day two Beach Bliss and Vibrant Markets. Okay, breakfast, beach friend, central market. Spend the morning swimming at the Sunset Beach. <laughs> you know how cold and freezing the UK beach waters are. Mm, someone should feed this AI. But still people swim as well. Okay. It depends on the weather. Wander through the busting central market. Okay, City Botanical Garden. Day 3, Museum, University Campus, Cable Car. Okay, that's that was not bad actually. It is good. Budgeting tips, eat like a local, opt for street food, local markets, smaller family-run restaurants. Public transport is your friend. Utilize buses, trams and subways. Consider purchasing a multi-day pass. Yeah, that's good. Look for free walking tours, public parks. Yes, there is a lot of free walking tours available. Free museum days. And scenic viewpoints. Yes, book in advance. Set a daily limit. That was really good. Look at that. Coastal city adventures. <laughs> Enjoy your trip. 2023. Mm. Okay. 
that was not bad. The image and failed this time. And let's explore this. What is this? App itself is here. Okay. And the editor is here. Okay. Hmm. What is that? Google Labs Discord. Look at this. Okay, if you want, you can discuss on it. And if you want, you can share the app. Copy the link. We share permission. Where is it? That is the share link. Look at that. Untitled Opal app. Generate personalized three-day itinerary plan for any city. You can just remix. Anyone can remix now. I'm going to give this link in the description. Play around with these guys if someone is interested. And do remix it. That's very early stage of this. And look at these people are playing around with this. Introducing Opal, new way to build your apps. And people, the world is bigger than the USA, you know. As I said, this app is only available for US users. And as the Google Lab explains, this is experimental and they are initially rolling out to the US to get feedback from the user and we'll use the data to evaluate if and when we should roll out more broadly. As you can see, I'm using VPN, Surfshark, I'm using United States. I could drop in a link if anyone is interested. Okay, That's it. That's all. We got it here. Sorry, sharing is unavailable. That's fine. We just have done enough with you. Opal. Okay, we can name our app. Mr. Wins. Travel plan. With that. Okay. Now, that's untitled Opal app. Come on. They need to let me refresh and see if it's coming. I could see a few bugs here. Ah, yeah. It's here. But I should pick it up really on the first when I come back. Okay. What would you build with Google Opal? No code? Drop your craziest app ideas or your dream city of travel assistant with Opal. Creating with AI is simple as describing exactly what you want. And this is just the beginning. It's going to be more advanced, more futuristic, more stable when it is going to be rolled out throughout the world. If you enjoyed this, don't forget to like, share and subscribe for more cool AI demos and tips. See you in the next one. Thank you. Bye.